Hey there, guys. This is Opposite World Gaming with Tyler. Hey, Gary. And, <laughs> and Gary. And we are here. We are here playing a scenario battle. And this scenario is in 1757, if I'm correct. And it is the outbreak of the Seven Year War of Prussia and Austria and the fr with Austria and the French. French. <laughs> So the Austrian army, the Prussian army here, ha is, has very highly trained troops, all of them, you know, cannons, cavalry, all that. And we, the much weaker Austrians and French, Austria, Austro-Franco army, are uh, ill-trained and we have much fewer men. Like our line infantry are half of what they actually should be. And actually, the infantry is a hundred less than it should be. City one point is only twenty. I only have sixty out of one hundred and twenty. So I have twenty out of one twenty. Twenty, jeez. So we are yeah. considerably weakened, and this is a battle we're probably going to lose unless we figure out some great strategy. So we're gonna get started right here, and I will see you on the battlefield. Oh God! All right, yep. and we're yep. <laughs> we're here. Um, yes. This is the Prussian army, much greater, much vaster, and this is the Austrian Franco army. Um, defend the left flank. I'm going to take all of my men and go to the right flank right here and just line up. This is what we will do. So I'm going to take the left flank. Oh, crap. Yes, the left flank is yours. Oh, God. Pull, pull all the men back. Pull the men back. Oh, God. Why am I pulling us back? Because we're going to get hit by the cannons, we need to get into the mountains. Okay, or you're going to okay, get okay. destroyed by the cannon, dude. I'm going to take my men. All except for my cannons. And run! Retreat! Just retreat, go! We've got to bottleneck them somehow, if we can do that. I'm going to have my cannons fire down upon these men. Yeah, if you can. Oh, dude, see this ridge on the left here, in the left flank? Yeah. See if you can get them up there. And then right. you can just fire down upon them. Uh, right, I'm gonna oh! Cannons. Dang you, dude, you're getting hit hard. I know, get back! I'm gonna pull my men up to the t this ridge. Alright, get back, Lim limber back up, and uh, get to the top of this ridge, my cannons. Oh, dude, this ridge on the right, actually. I'm setting my cavalry here. You can set it right here, it's gonna be perfect. Cause it, it looks straight down. Oh, yeah, dude, you got, took some hits. Yes, yes, I know. I've me retreating my men. Oh god. All right, I'm going to move my cavalry up there. Where are my cannons? Wonder if you can take the cavalry on the rear. You take it way, way, way on the left flank, and you just come straight around and whip them from the back. That could work. I mean, I could try that with the units if you want me to. Oh, God. All right, let's just have all of our men set up on this ridge at this moment. All right, that works. All right, get on that ridge, guys, because Frederick, Frederick II is literally coming to us, and he's going to kill us all. Like, I mean, look at this. I think this. I could probably take my... Um, What are they? My, um... Crusaders? I can my, my Crusaders. Uh -huh. And move them uh, around to their very right. Yeah. To their very left flank, and hit them from behind. But I don't know what level fair, because I can definitely take some of the cannons, unless they're moving yeah, the cannons. I, well, they their very left is cannons, and they're having their their cavalry move left to, I believe, defend said they cannons. Have two, so. They have two 12-pounder foot artilleries. Yeah. That's that's the problem I am having. Where where are you guys down here? Oh, my artillery's. Where are you Yo, guys going? Twelve pounders going forward. I don't know. I just realized they're moving. I just realized they are marching towards. I'm like, where in the hell? Right, I want you men here. I want you running there, because you are cannons. You guys can be exhausted when you get up there. I'm pulling my cavalry there. way back, and I'm gonna keep my foot soldiers in the front. I, I have reason to believe they uh, have no plan on moving. Nope, they're moving. <laughs> oh, are they coming towards us? No, they look like they're just marching right. 
Wow, that, that was an intense couple of first seconds of the battle. I was like, well, <laughs> we're screwed. We're screwed. Yeah, that was, that was my... I, I only have two cannons left out of all of that. Two of my cannons survived the uh, barrage. Ah, oh, dang, dude. I believe it says I only have two. I might, I don't, did I, you already... Did you only start with two? No. Oh, no, I have more. I have four. All four of my cannons survived the battle. Yeah, I was say. You should have all your... I want you lot to de-limber. Unlimber. And... Oh, no! Get away from those, you savages! Did you have have them double time? Yeah, no, they can't double time. These these are not the kind that double time. These are the oh, kind right, they're that cannons. just go. These are just twelve pound artilleries. My six pound artillery are drawn by horse, which is lucky for them. Because now they can fire down. All right, um, Instead I'm gonna advise you to Twelve pounders on our right flank. Dude. What? Right where your horses are, your general's body set up the. Um, Set up the 12 pounder to the just right of them on that uh, hill. That's kind of yeah. bumpy. Right there, right there. This is where this yeah. is where they will be. This is where I want you lads to set up. So I'm gonna advise you to move your uh, French army just a little so that my cannon. Actually, you know what? Never mind. I'll move my I'll move my cannons for you. I'm gonna take one of my one of my regiments of crusaders. No, no, no! Don't around. fire! Don't fire! You fuckers! Ooh, don't curse. Why? No, I was talking to my cannons. Oh. They, uh... Right, well, that's something to do. I'll take a, a bridge. No, uh, you know what? They can fire. You know what? You, you guys... Fire! You might want to use your grape shot if you're, when they get really close. I know how to use grape shot. Just saying, bro. Are they firing? No, they're... They're figuring out what they're doing. Alright, well, you know what, I'll, while, they're, while they're on horse, might as well move them up so that I don't accidentally fire into your line. Right. Yeah, please don't kill my men. Alright, so... Oh, well, let's just wait for the, for the Prussian army to come, so that uh, accidents don't happen, I guess. I'm moving a sneak attack around to the side. Hopefully they don't see me. I think they're too busy watching us. Alright, and now on Limber. Come on, you Germans. Alright, so actually, fun fact, uh, my timer isn't working, so once my recording thing stops recording, it's going to be complete and total guess. So, it'll be fine, though. Everything is going to be alright. Every little thing... Gonna be all right. Does it make a ding or something when it ends? No, but my little uh, frame rate thing up in the top left corner is going to suddenly uh, spike. Suddenly go green rather than it being red. Uh, let's see. I'm going to f fix my target. Who should I start shooting? Ah, oh, damn! Way out of range. I'm gonna have to wait for them to actually come in. So your sneak attack on their. You should probably hit their cannons pretty hard. Cause yeah, that's what I'm gonna try to hit. Although, I don't know how, how much I'm going to be able to hit with all these... Oh, bollocks. They're sending... They have a lot of Dragoons and Crusaders and... Oh no, they're firing into our line! How? They have one serious 12... 24 pound cannon. That's how. Well, they only have 12s. They only have 12s? Yeah, it's a 12 pounder. Might have been a really, really lucky shot. Probably. I have 12 pounders. Let's see if my 12 pounder foot artillery can uh can do that. Right, I want you lads set right here. Yeah, it was an incredibly lucky shot. That's all it was. All right. So that was almost really bad for a couple of seconds. What? the beginning of the battle. Oh yeah, that was bad. Oh my god, dude, you almost realized what? all their units are upgraded. Oh no, I realized that a long time ago, when the video started. Uh, right. So... Let's see what am I doing here. Let's see, 
how far I can shoot. Not far enough, but I'm going to take a pot shot at their line and see what happens. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. I see your men slowly but surely traipsing around the edge. Shh. Don't tell them I'm doing that. They'll get really pissed. I imagine. I'd be pretty mad if I saw the enemy traipsing around the edge of my battlefield. Luckily, they're a little busy firing at me. So. Um, well, I'm the one watching the front here, so... Hit him with your 12 footers. Yeah, your 12 pounders. it's not working. They, yeah. they aren't firing. How are how are they able to hit hit us from so far, but we can't even like graze them? I don't even know. They got a nice pot shot right into the middle of my. Uh... No, they just missed. Dude, they missed. Dude, he hasn't even realized. Where am I Wait, maybe uh. Do you want me to head straight to the twelve foot? Their twelve pounders or their general's bodyguard? Um, general's bodyguard. Well. Uh... Whichever you see would work slightly better, because I really don't even know. I'm going to hit the 12 pounders. Alright. Because their dragoons and all that are on the side, and uh, I think they're just lying in wait. While yep. you do that, I'm actually... Uh, tell me when you strike, because I'm going to wait here and move my men about. Well, please don't move your dragoons into the dangers up, my guys. I think you really pissed. How's your frame uh, right there, Tyler? Actually, really good. Has the record stopped yet? Uh, still recording. Everything's going really well. Okay. I'm actually gonna watch your charge. This is gonna be awesome. Yeah, that's what we. For that's Narnia! what we said. Did you just say for Narnia? Yeah, I did. I, I'd say for the Holy Roman Empire or something like that. I don't know. Or Napoleon. Napoleon. Oh yeah, your French. I guess that's a proper. Alright, I'm gonna tell you if anybody decides to do anything. Somebody's taking out two of their cans and half their men. Oh, they're doing they something. They're doing care. something about oh, you attacking them. They care. They care. They care a lot. They care a lot. Okay, I'm pulling out. Oh, the inappropriate jokes. Oh, shut up. Alright, well, you broke their cannons, so, um, run. Oh no, they're hussars! Oh, crap. <laughs> oh no! I want to hit as hard as I can. Yeah. I'm gonna just let these guys die. I think, yeah. I know that sounds really bad, but I was about to say I think you're out of options. I was gonna have that's to work about right all now. you can do right now. Oh, they seriously outnumber you and out and outrank you. This is just not your best. This is just not those. But uh, hey, I took care of their cannons. Battle. That's all that matters. Okay. No, dear. Hey, I am not doing a very bad job. Well, not really. 17 out of 30, they have 80 out of 80, 74 out of 80, you're doing a bad job. No I'm not, dude, I've taken out so many of their men. Not from what I'm seeing, not I oh, took out no. three cannons before that, so they had time to fix it on my men and kill me. They just charged me. Okay, now I'm not broke again. Now, now the, 79 out of 80, 71 out of 80, dude, I have 29, not 29 out of 30. 28 out of 30, 57 out of 60. I'm actually going okay, to... I did a pretty decent job with those men. I took out 18 men in the cannon regiment. They only have one cannon left that's fleeting because it's routed. They're not even going to let your men retreat. Alright, so no, I'm going to end this recording and start a new one. So, see you in the next video.